Classic crackles are designed to create crackle patterns during the firing process, traditionally used to create a vintage or antique appeal. Classic crackles are non-toxic, lead-free, and a low-fire glaze. Notice the AP seal, which indicates non-toxic and lead-free. This symbol indicates that classic crackles are not suitable for dinnerware due to the surface characteristics. It is a term we use to describe situations where it may not be desirable to use a particular glaze for dinnerware even though it passed the food safety testing. Due to the surface characteristics of classic crackles, the crackles could potentially trap bacteria. Since earthenware is not dishwasher recommended, it is difficult to sanitize and the earthenware bisque may absorb water and fail. There are four colors in the classic crackle line. Transparent, white, green tea, and China Sea. The crackle pattern in the glaze is actually a firing defect called crazing. Simply put, crazing occurs when the glaze shrinks more than the body. The tension of the glaze on the body causes the glaze to crack. In this case of the classic crackles, it is our intent to develop a glaze that will not fit an earthenware body, creating this wonderful fired effect. Classic crackle is a three coat glaze applied in one direction. We're going to create test tiles with all of the classic crackle glazes on bare bisque, over fundamentals underglaze, and over one thin coat of stroke and coat. Again, as a rule of thumb, Classic crackles do not typically work well over a glaze. That's why it's important to do one thin coat. Each test tile is going to have the classic crackles applied in the same order. The first section is transparent, the second one will be white, the third is green tea, and the fourth is China Sea. We're going to apply three coats, allowing the glaze to dry until the shine is off the glaze. That's a good rule of thumb. When the shine is off the glaze, then apply the next coat. This allows it to have a little bit of tooth to grab hold of the next layer of glaze. Let's look at the fired results of Classic Crackles. This is on bare bisque and it's did its job with fine lines and crazy. This is over one thin coat of stroke and coat. We're pleased to show it crackled over the one thin coat, but will not over three coats. And the last tile is over fundamental underglaze. You can see Classic Crackles looks different over colors. The crackling or crazing is not as obvious. Now that it's fired, it's important to stain the classic crackles to highlight the glaze. Pour out the softies acrylics onto a palette and use a soft cloth, or in this case, we're using a coffee filter. Wipe on the softies acrylics over the classic crackles. Then wipe off the excess stain. This highlights the crackles for the antique look. Depending on how much you need to do, you may want to wear gloves. The most often asked question is, after somebody pulls this out of the kiln, they say it didn't crackle. This second step is what is important to show the highlights of the classic crackles. Look how beautiful that just pops. It really highlights all of the crazing or crackling in the colors. Again, using classic crackle over colors does change some of the look. And as you can see, it's pretty simple to do. Now on this darker color, it's harder to see the classic crackles at work. Once highlighted though, you're gonna see a big difference. And this again is where the consumers sometimes think that the classic crackles did not work. Sometimes letting the classic crackle sit for a day or two will enhance the crazing or crackling of the glaze. Sometimes right out of the kiln it just doesn't show as much, but allowing it to do its job over a couple of days does work. Let's troubleshoot just in case it did not craze. You can thermal shock the bisque by taking it out of the kiln a little warmer than we normally would. That will help increase the crazing. Another option is to spritz the ware while it's still warm. 
that can help with the thermal shock. And the clay body might just fit too good. Try another clay body to see if you get the crackling. Classic crackles can be used with designer liner. You can paint on top of it with stroke and coat. You can combine classic crackles. And look at this beauty with elements, pottery cascades, and stroke and coat. Thank you.